Listen, everyone. All is in place. We may be there. Lambert, prepare the apparatuses. Escort, go. As I heard, my dear, hey, Sal, I give up? the orders around here, not you. I believe we made an agreement to seek to cure Uma my way. I said we would help you, that's it. I don't know what you want to do with them, you haven't deigned to inform us. But it's not safe, is it? Just as I thought. Which is why I think we should first try another, less invasive method. Don't take this the wrong way, Vesemir. But clock's ticking. I ask only one night's delay. If nothing comes of it, we'll do what Yennefer wants. I'll take Uma into the mountains. What then? Will you howl at the moon together? A bit of respect. <laughs> You're not talking to Geralt. No, we will not howl at the moon. I'll lay him down on a gravestone. Come midnight, I'll give him tea made of hemlock harvested from... But I don't see that I need to explain this to you. In my opinion... I know your opinion, but I'm not asking anyone's permission. I'm saying what will happen. I'll be back at dawn, with Uma, or whoever hides inside him. So, got the evening off. What do we do with it? Vesemir mentioned some roof beams in the tower need replacing. Maybe we could see to that. Or, we could have a drink. Sounds a lot better than the beams. Wouldn't mind a shot myself, or two. Nothing I can do, been outvoted. Let's go. Do as you will, but in a moment. Geralt and I must talk. Ooh, sounds serious. Come on, Lambert. See you in a bit, Geralt. Something not quite right? No, nothing. I just wanted to take you aside without cluing the others into what we're up to. Mm-hmm. And what are we up to? Sneaking upstairs to make love. Wow. You don't exactly mince words. I'm too old to play the blushing bride. Unless you ask nicely. Shall we go? You can rejoin them afterwards. In an hour. Or two. Or three. I'll hold you to that. What's happening? Oh. Well, well. Lovebirds decided to join us. Enjoy yourselves? You heard the answer to that question, Lambert. Besides, not our business. I love how I uh, how Yen, much I rest we don't have glasses. You alright drinking from a mug? I'd drink from an old boot tonight. <sighs> Perhaps instead of getting crocked in deep glum, we could do some catching up. Eventful times for me recently. Kings, dragons, conspiracies. And then, I found Yen. Yeah, we're thrilled for you. But why don't you tell us about Uma instead? Nah, bro, I'm like, not a big fan. I didn't expect that. <sighs> no, I was on, actually on my phone, I was, I was on just using options. Trail. Went to Velen, Skellige, Novigrad, I thought the same. Needed saving again. It's just the, he it's part of the dialogue. Whatever you do, she right. would say that. Speaking of old friends, Novigrad and Plowing, how's Triss? We were talking about Uma, weren't we? The night is young. Got time to talk about everything. Lambert, not funny. Fine. Conversation turned serious. Let's talk. Yen, what do you plan to do with Uma? I said I'd tell you tomorrow. So tell us now. It's after midnight. 
I'll subject him to the trial of grasses, but only- You fucking what?! <laughs> Mind your manners, Lambert. Did you hear what- Not gonna ask you again. <laughs> uh, sorry. Looking to turn him into a witcher? Of course not. As I was about to say, <laughs> that I'll was only apply the first half of the trial because, because you want to watch him suffer? Stop interrupting or I will watch you suffer. To restore Uma's former appearance, <laughs> we must first... <laughs> you want to turn him into a witch? That was, explain it. that was the best line ever. Imagine a lump of clay. In order to shape it, you must first moisten it or it will crumble. The trial's initial part does just that. It opens the body imagine, to change, Imagine so to Uma <laughs> Only then can the mutagent uh, um, produce a witcher. Uh, what do you call it? Uh, a wolf medallion in <laughs> hunting monsters with the same look. It'll be the first trial in years, decades. I knew you'd be wary. Wary? That's not the problem. Those secrets have been forgotten, and that's how they should stay. I'd be the last to suggest you start producing hordes of witches. You hardly need to. See, till now we had a great excuse not to take in apprentices. Seems we'll need to talk it over. Maybe later. Who's up for another round? Oh, I am. But we're all out of stuff to chew on. Geralt, mind raiding the kitchen? Not at all. Gentlemen, pleasure drinking with you. Lambert, especially. But the hour is late. Don't stay up long. Tomorrow's an important day. <laughs> Didn't listen, did he? They never do. Yes, I did. What are you talking about? Sam Avila contract. Was it a Eskel bug or someone back. intentionally Good did story. it? Good story. Finish it in a minute. First, some more fuel. Ooh, now that's a kick in the liver. What is it? The gauntlet. Equal parts spirit and white gull. What's that look about? Yen's gone to bed. Time for some serious drinking. Damn straight. Pour us another. Bottoms up. this about a Sama Villa? Snared this peasant in her dance. Instead of being happy, he escaped with his life. Yokel fell head over heels in love. Wanted me to trap her. Turned him down. So he tried it on his own with a fishing net. Bet you they're still dancing a mazurka in some fallow field. Great story. With a moral, too. Really? What's that? Stay away from dangerous women. Will you ever lay off Yen? Yeah, as soon as I trust her. You brave a fire for her. Whereas she plays you like a cheap fiddle. Way it's always been. Listen to you two goddamn relationship experts. Neither of you's been with a sorceress. For good reason. I agree. Fine. It was, it was Leave pretty boy alone worse. before he gets grumpy. Already has that pouty look on his face. I can't stand it. Drink up, girl. To you and Yen. Happily ever after. <sighs> Colder and up a nice giant's ass in here. Gentlemen, I shall return. Gotta go dream dragon. Gotta say, I'm pretty warm. He's always been a wuss about the cold. Remember winter 15 years ago, when the snow stayed around until Bellatane? Mm-hmm. Lambert sat by the fire, wrapped in a blanket. Cussed copiously every time it started to snow. Hello, youngins. Got your own little carnival going, eh? 
Alcohol, my good men, is a witcher's worst enemy. Where did you dig up that bonnet? Vesemir's trunk. The height of fashion in 1112. Old man probably put it on when he went courting. Or in the jargon of the time, wooing the damsels. Men, a witcher's life is not all cards and liquor. It is toil. It is labor. No gurgling babes to wean for us. Nay, not for us. All right. One Vesemir is enough. Take that off before you get it dirty. And pour. Oh, I'll pour, Esco. I'll pour. To the brim. Because without vodka, you're as stiff as a bookkeeper in a body cast. Come on, let's have some fun. Are we boring you? No, it's just kind of... Slow. Pretty boy's right. Listen, there's this game student from Oxenford taught me. Hmm? Someone starts by saying, I've never, and finishing the sentence however they want. Who's ever done that thing downs a shot. Then it's the next guy's turn. Sounds great. You start. I've never... Slept with a succubus. How about that? Expected Geralt might have, but you? Esco, Esco, still waters run deep. I'm a sucker for women with horns. Right, my turn. I've never, after a bender, woken up wearing nothing but my knickers. Geralt? Lambert's a lost cause, but you? What would Papa Vesemir say? Think Papa Vesemir would have drank that round too. To all right, Geralt, your turn. I've never... Taken Fistek. Askel. Really? Once. It wasn't, I wasn't expecting Askel to, you know, snap Fistek. Right, man. Let's end on that. Or else I'll never be able to look you in the eyes again. <sighs> Vodka. The vodka's gone. Who's gonna go get some more? Already went to get food. All right, I'll do it. Kitchen. It's that way, right? Listen, you... you got a problem with me? Me? What? Why would you say that? Well, it just seems that way. You know, you're a little like my little brother. Dumb and annoying. But a brother. Geralt... Damn it! You're gonna make me cry! Come here! Damn. Broke. Good thing it was empty. Where's Esco? Should have been back by now. We had to look around. Esco had like this is a job green. for Vesemir. Nah, again, take that hat off. Where's that whippersnapper wandered off to? He could be beleaguered. I wager. Come, men, to the rescue. Spilled some wine, and crawled through it. Had to kneel down to see that? If I'd have bent over, I'd have puked. Esco, you drunk! Get out of here! Esco! 
Eskel! Eskel! Eskel, you drunk! Get out here! Hey, you hear that? Sounded like panting. Uh, you know what I'm wounded wyvern. Damn it! I might start playing. We the fight. Heart of Stone, and not finish the game like the base game. Uh, uh, I'm gonna go talk to that go, woman who chop, chop. slept with Vesemir uh, in uh, Bersodi's um, auction, let's and then I'm gonna go. have a conversation with Vesemir. Esco! Esco! I think he. Apparently, there's a unique. He hurt himself. There. What's one and then scar I'm gonna, more or um, less in you this know, case? Get that dialogue in which uh, Gondor Dims tells you how you save Siri. Hey, look, there he is. With his ever faithful little bleeder. <laughs> Hello, Esco. Wake up. Uh, what? What happened? Got sloshed, stewed, and 57 other varieties of drunk. That's what happened. Get up. Time to have a drink. Leave me alone. I'm gonna puke. Three of us get together, always ends like this. Let's find a fourth. Better. A woman. Nothing here but Yen. Uh, we don't want to wake her up, believe me. What about that sorceress you talked to? Think about it. We turn on the megascope, cordially invite her, she teleports here. <laughs> Maybe bring some friends. How's that sound? <laughs> Lambert, you're a genius. Of course I am. So, we inviting the lodge to our bash? Fuck yeah! Summon the bitches! All right. How's this work? Well, a twist here, a turn there, and you gotta say something in Elvish. Easy peasy, let's do it. Hey, hang on. When this Ida sees us, we'll scare her off. I mean, we don't look anything like sorceresses. I know. Yennefer's clothes. Let's dress up. Bags are over there. What's this thing you got for dressing up? Shut it, wise ass, or I'll lace your corset up so tight you'll shit in your bloomers. Nah. Uh, I don't really like the idea either. Fine. But if this Ida refuses to talk to us, it'll be your fault. Now, I'll do the talking. You two fiddle with the crystals. Kedmil Blodetwa. Hocus pocus, I reckon that brass brother. What is this? Who's that? So sorry. We were never here. Guards! More paper, Excellency! No, off. Witches! Witches attacking! <laughs> <laughs> I trust you have an explanation for this. A very good one. Who sleeps wearing lingerie like that? Go to bed. Now! now.